Hello, this is Michelle Knight. This is the astrological update for Cancer for the week starting the 27th of February. Wow, how are you? How was that big old eclipse yesterday or on the 26th? Have you recovered? Are you dealing with that? Did you have a psychic revelation? Anyway, this week it's all change as you're all about your career. You are determined to succeed and your energy is pretty much focused on that. Yes, you do have to find balance between career and family. On the 27th, Mars is in your position of career. Make you go, yeah, come on, want to succeed. Let's go, go, go. And maybe you've you got to be careful not to ride roughshod over family members. You may be like, come on now, we can expand and we can grow. We can change things. But, you know, there are a few commitments that you have to stick to. But your heart wants freedom to follow your career. Fair enough. Just be gentle while doing it. On the 1st, we have the moon, your ruler, in your career place conjunct venus mars and uranus so you are full on about your career the, everything's caught up in it from your love life to your energy to unexpected things happening around your career so you've got to ride that wild horsey of career energy this week there may be unpredictable things happen but then use them to your advantage use the intuition of the moon to follow through we also have on the second the Sun conjunct Neptune um, in your position of adventure. There may be an adventure that you're meant to go on and it's important that you tune in and listen to it. It may be a message from someone from a different culture or who's unusual in some way or somebody suggesting that you learn something. But whatever it is, if it's right, it totally resonates with your soul and spirit. You feel it all the way through you because of that Neptune energy. We then have... Um, um, Venus, the planet of love going retrograde, and this is a big deal. It all harks back to events that happened in the spring of 2009. And for you, it could have been all about your career. So how does your love life affect your career? Do you kind of focus on love more or career more? In 2009, was there a turning point for you? Was there a job or a relationship and you gave up one for the other or you didn't find enough compromise? Whatever it is, that dynamic may come back into play. Or it could be something as simple as someone you worked with back in the day pops up and there's a chemical romantic attraction. Or indeed, actually, there could be a flirtation or attraction at work. Whatever happens, that energy seems to be around you at the moment. But Venus is saying, come on out, you need to sort things out. For you to go forward, you have to go backwards and look at your patterns, particularly when it comes to the balance of love and work and how you manage those things. Now, on the 5th, it's a great day for you to really dig in and lay some foundations career-wise. You're very, very focused as you've got Mars, Trine, Saturn. You're, you're, you're energised, you're powerful, and Saturn is going, take care of the details and I'll sort out the rest. You have to be careful about everything you commit to and you do, but you have the drive to see it through this week. Have a stunning week, take care, and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks for listening, and please, if you haven't yet, It'd be great if you could subscribe, share, like, or comment. Take care. See you next week.